exclusive and welcome back to some more FIFA 21 content. Today we are doing uh, a bit of a pack opening today, it's a bit of a, a bit of a dead content day and I didn't really feel like playing um, playing any rivals today so I thought why not as we've got the new release of uh, Icon Swaps which I've take you through here I've been grinding a few of the uh, squad battles ones because predominantly all of the Icon Swaps are now in squad battles um, and the French and the first owner, very easy stuff just first owner French teams um, and gets that done. But yeah, we've got to spend those on the two ultimate packs. We've got two very, very big packs waiting. So we also got an 86 plus and we've got a few 100k packs in store as well. So hopefully we can uh, pick up something half decent. But yeah, before I did that, I also want to mention a few things. I want to obviously thank everyone who's been uh, joining us on, on the channel, been joining the uh, the team exclusive. Uh, it's really good to see and I, I do want to thank everyone who has been supporting this channel uh, recently. It, it really does mean the world to me and um, you know it's making this uh, making this dream slightly more possible um, and more of a reality really as well because all I started this channel to do was just to kind of entertain people especially over lockdown and you know the periods where we're all stuck at home it's all getting a bit you know down and depressed. I, I, that's you know providing a little bit of entertainment and that's all it's about and also it helps me take my mind off things and it's just quite nice as well so hopefully you're enjoying your stay and um yeah with that said what was the other thing um yeah they've ruined squad battles ea i don't need to talk about i'm sure you already know but uh yeah ea have uh, ruined that they've put them mainly in in um not squad but they've ru they've ruined icon swaps um and they've just put them all in squad battles now so you can't do the golden goal rule which is a bit sad it's a little bit sad from ea's part um but we all saw it coming you know i took part in the golden goal rule because it was a easier way to complete the objectives it was quite nice you know it was a community effort thing yeah what's this oh that was depressing um yeah it was a community effort thing that i thought was really quite cool to be fair you know it, it allowed us to do the objective a little bit quicker um we got a thing obviously the people people argued that they wanted to play with their their teams their players fair enough you know I was never a player that forced somebody to quit after a goal you know if I if I scored I didn't I never expected somebody to quit Fra oh what's this hey oh let's go Edward Edward never heard of this guy I oh, know I have actually but okay anyway um yeah I was never somebody who like scored a goal paused and then um and then force somebody to quit but if if i scored and they pause and they quit fair enough i would do it back to somebody else if they scored i'd pause and quit you know it's just it was just one of those so it's a bit sad for me that they've kind of um taken away why not just like implement a, a game mode specifically for golden goal instead of giving us a limit on uh, actually, i actually want to quickly check his price as well yeah dead um yeah just put in like a golden goal thing that'd be really cool I think that'd be really good fun. Really, really good fun. But EA won't do it because they hate fun. They hate fun. Anyway, we do get a board out of that one. It was a 75 plus. That was pretty decent. Alex Tellers, let's go. Bit of a beast. Still worth 15,000 coins. That's crazy. It's crazy. Not that I'm going to use him, but that's pretty cool. Um, so let's go over to the store. Let's whack over these. I can't. I can't foresee us getting anything too good, but you never know. There's three in store. Can we? It's just a bit, just a bit sad, isn't it? It's just a bit sad. Oh, Nana, you do not love to see it. Jesus Christ. Hey, Iron Robin. And we get a few nice players like Kanate. We get Kanji. I suppose that's quite cool. Get he might be slightly expensive um antonio might be and he is a little bit is 2k probably just because of the icon swaps um but nobody really that uh that interesting to be honest we'll keep keep a lot of the players because they're always good for the first owner teams and that kind of stuff for possible icon swaps if i do want to do them but not looking likely hey i'll walk out let's go ah oh, it's not a special card but english Striker, Harry Kane. Jesus Christ. Um, and we get Insigne as well. That's not bad, to be fair. I mean, Harry Kane, he's worth... It's worth a good 50k. 
Insigne is worth... Well, he's almost extinct as well, Jesus. He is going extinct. Oh my, wow, okay. Um, That's surprising. So, why is Insigne going extinct? There's like, there's only one page of him. There's only like six on the market. Why is he... I will stick him up there and wait for him to go extinct and then sell him for mad money. <laughs> um, what else we get? We get Cunha. It's not bad. It's worth a few thousand coins. So what? I mean, that's 50... Got about like about 80, 80k though. We get Fraser. He's newly added to the game. You do love to see it. It's not worth anything, but it's good to see him back in the, back in the Prem. Um, nobody really else. Okay. Bit, it's a bit dead. I mean, Harry Kane's not bad because he is quite... He is quite useful I suppose but uh, and he's slightly expensive but come on you want to see one of those orange orange cards come on headliners yo it's a walkout oh, come on Hyung Min Son okay Hyung Min Son that's not terrible how much is Hyung Min Son nowadays it was getting inform and Leroy Sane inform is worth next to nothing so we'll just get rid of him Son's worth another 50k as well and Sane, it's another 20,000, so that's another like 70, 80,000 coin uh, pack right there. It's not terrible. Let's get Paulinho, Lopez I'll stick up. All those I'll kind of keep. Zuma. Zuma's a little bit to be fair, but probably because of the uh, whole SB or the uh, icon swaps things. Eric Bailly. Hey, yo, why is Eric Bailly so much? He's another 2,000 coins as well. Decent, decent stuff. We get Minamino. Okay. Not terrible, fair. That's not terrible. You do love to see it. That's kind of a... You know, that's a lot of profit we've made there. In fairness. It's quite a lot of profit. Well, I mean, we didn't really spend any actual money on it. So it's not really profit. But, you know, profit is profit and all that. Probably the most expensive thing in the pack, to be honest. A few position change cards. I'll stick those up. And we get a thousand coins as well. Not bad. Not too bad, but now is the time. So, the time has come. We're going to do the ultimate packs because I feel like because they are icon swaps, material, and they're untradeable, they're going to be gash. They're going to be terrible because they're from EA. I could be wrong, and I'm hoping I'm wrong. It's not walkout. I what did I say? I mean, we got cucked by a Libertadores or a Suda Medicana. I can't remember the difference. But who's going to be in the pack? Come on, drum roll, please. Wow, okay. Wow. So we got cucked by not just one Libertadores, we got cucked by four. <laughs> four. You, ca you can't make this shit up. You can't, like, <sighs> yeah, uh, I'm just going to fucking quick some. I don't actually give a shit. Um, so we got 83. Uh, Jorginho and Vertonghen. Now uh, you do love to see it. Now we've got a ton of players. I suppose that's quite good. We also had Tadic, wow. Jesus Christ. And uh, Rui Diaz. I, uh, good lord, wow. Okay, come on. Second one, please. EA, deliver us one of these orange Bruno Fernandes. Not even a walkout. What is this? Like, packs you're given by EA are trash. Are complete trash. Well, who wants a Rodri? I mean, I, I guess that's okay because he's a. Uh, 85, it's not a terrible pack in fairness, but it's not what you want to see, is it? 85, 84, and 83. Jesus is quite nice. It's quite a nice player to get. Another 83 as well. So I, I guess I can't really complain. We've got some fodder in the club. But uh, you, it's just not what you want to see, is it? It's not much you can do, really. I mean, packs are packs, aren't they? They give out what they give out. So I was hoping we might get something uh, slightly more enticing than um, just some standard walkouts. But, I mean, this could be the moment of truth. Guaranteed a walkout, 86 rated plus player. If this is an 86, I don't know, David, uh, not David Luiz, 86 uh, David Silver or something like 86 rated player standard, I'm going to end the video there, basically. So, see what it is. We'll see what it is. If the video ends in five seconds, you know we've got an 86. Uh, if not, then uh, we got something better. It's obviously a walkout. Ooh, what was that? French? Striker? Yo, PSG? Yo, we got Mbappe! Oh my god. 
Oh my god. <laughs> we just got him Bappe. What? <laughs> what is this? That is mad. That is mad luck. I... <laughs> You can't write this shit. You really can't. Wow. Can you imagine if he was tradable as well? That'd be crazy. He's one point. We always get the most expensive players just untradable. Not that I'm complaining at all. Not that I'm complaining. But now we've got an untradable Kylian Mbappe. Like, I just, I just don't know at this point. I just, I just don't know. Wow. Wow. Jesus Christ. Five star, four star, high low. I mean, he's it's Mbappe. We all we've all come up against Mbappe. He's fucking insane. Just Wow. Okay, well there we go. We didn't we didn't get an 86. We didn't get an 86. Who would have thought we got a 90 rated Mbappe? And you know it's crazy because and you could always say, oh, you know, you're just making this shit up. But literally, before I was doing this video. Before I even uh, opened the pack, when I saw it in store, I thought, you know, oh, you know, we're just going to get Mbappe or something. You know, that'd be sick. And then we got Mbappe. So, wow. Wow. I don't know how to fit him in my team. Like, my team keeps changing because I keep getting these really sick players I want to play with. He would have been good for the uh, the first donor, French. Um, French, whatever you call it. I want to get my team. That's not my team. Where is my team? I can't believe that. I can't believe we got Mbappe. I can't believe that. That's mental. Wow. But yeah, so, I mean, obviously, you've, if you've been around the channel for a while, you'll know how different our team has been over the past few months or so. Um, changed because um, because we obviously packed Messi, so, you know, we'll have to stick him in the team. We packed Maradona. and have the icon pack, so we'll have to put him in the team. Um, we obviously got Jao Felix and all that kind of stuff. But, like, now, how do we... How do we get Mbappe in the team? I don't know. Oh my god. Wow. That's one hell of a way to end it. I mean, that is one hell of a way to end it. Jesus Christ. So, you can't, you can't make it up. You really can't. You can't. I, uh, if he was tradable, I would have, I would have lost my shit. Obviously he's untradable, so it's a bit, eh. It's a bit what it is, but it's Mbappe. So who doesn't want Mbappe? Um, holy shit, I just can't believe that. That's mental. Our road to glory. Um, like, look at look at this. This is all like road to glory stuff. Yeah, we spent FIFA points, but that's part of our road to glory. Like, you know, I'm not limiting us to not spending actual money. I just don't want to go crazy with it. And uh, you know, like we've got the Iron Robin there as well, which we managed to do for like, I say. 20,000 coins, but that was like spending actual coins on that. Um, all the rest was just players we packed from packs that I could either have sold or put them into an SBC. So I know it's probably actually like 140k, but realistically, we only spent 20,000 of our actual coins to uh, to do that. And I, like, look at that card. And then all these other SBC ones we've done and just completed and objectives and, and RT. It's so sick. Our Road to Glory is so sick. And now we've just got an Mbappe to add to the mix and I don't know what to do with him. Do I still have that inform Bamba? I don't think I do, do I? Because I think I got rid of him. Ah, uh, that blows. Well, that would have been quite useful to have, but unfortunately we don't have that anymore. Either way, there we go. And what a way to end it. What a way to end it. Packing Killian Mbappe. Jesus Christ. Yeah, like, uh, I don't know. I don't know. You really, you really can't make it up. And it's every time that I spend actual money on this game when I when I trade up uh, to have untradeable like SBC packs in store. We always pack something incredibly sick. Happened with Messi, put on 12,000 FIFA points or whatever, 24, and then we opened our SBC packs from marquee matchups and packed Messi. And it's like, well, what's the point? What's the point? It's like EA is saying, don't give us money. Um, so, I don't know, but there we go. Wow, wow. Hopefully you enjoyed that. Um, it was quite a lengthy wait to see an actual good pack, but we got there in the end. To be fair, though, we got um, Harry Kane, Human Son. Yeah, they're not the, the highest rated players or the best players in the world, but they are money and fodder, so it's it's always good to have. Um, but either way, do hope you enjoyed. Uh, obviously, I do want to say a massive thank you to everyone who has been subscribing recently. It really does mean a lot, and hopefully you are enjoying the content. Uh, obviously, it's just going to get better and better in the future. And now we've got Mbappe. We'll be in 
in, in Division 1 in no time. Obviously, that's a joke because I am shite. There we go. Hopefully, I've enjoyed. Um, if you have, please do drop this video a like. That'd be very, very much appreciated. Uh, if you want to see more of this content and you haven't already, do hit that subscribe button and become part of the exclusive family. You don't want to, don't want to miss um, what's coming in the future because hopefully, you know, team of the year, our pack luck has been pretty on, so I'm just I'm just saying you cross the T's, dot the I's and all that kind of stuff. That's, that's what I'm saying. But uh, if you do want to stick around, do hit the subscribe button and become part of the exclusive family. Um, it'd be great to have you. But with that said, do hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time.